Hello, in this video I will show you how easy it is to replace the diaphragm on a professional high frequency driver. This is a uh, RCF made EAW branded CD2520 driver. Few specifications about this driver, throat exit 1 inch, mounting type bolt on, the nominal impedance is 8 ohms and the frequency response 1200 to 20,000 Hz. Power handling 50 Watt continuous and 100 Watt program. It has a phenolic diaphragm with a 44.4 mm copper voice coil. There are three screws attaching the voice coil assembly to the magnet. This is the back cover of the compression chamber with some uh, damping material on it. The membrane is glued on a plastic ring. This ring keeps the coil centered inside a magnetic gap. There's a plastic dome attached to the centerpiece of the magnet. The sound waves are traveling from the membrane through the holes in the dome and through the hole in the centerpiece of the magnet and they are exiting on the front of the speaker. Unlike the regular tweeter, a compression driver has the membrane located behind the magnet and the inside part of the membrane is radiating the sound forward through the magnet. This is a M65 replacement diaphragm. Before sliding the new kit in place, the holes in the ring needs to be perfectly aligned to the holes in the plate. Same thing for the back cover. This is how the diaphragm kit looks like. The magnet has uh, 134 millimeters in diameter and the whole driver weighs about 2.8 kilograms. Thank you for watching.